So we up in the shop trying to get some more work done. Super hot. I had to just clean and rearrange everything. Had fluid messes all over the floor, but we in the game. So let's check it out. It just clean up all this. So I can see we got baby blue to the side, looking beautiful as possible. Got this joint about to get buzzed down. Then we got the silver and cranberry joint. And you already know root beer about to be up out of here. Gotta just throw that exhaust in the handlebars, but we got it going. I have to clean up all this stuff, dude. When you have like, you already see how many bikes. One, two, three, four, five, six, six bikes. That's why I haven't even disassembled that bike how I want to, because I know I have three on edge, about to be out of here in like a day or so. So it's just like, I'd rather wait till I got the full space to go crazy and take it apart like this. But y'all see what's going on, man. We trying to get them in and out, huh, Ace? Yeah. Hey, we working. Yeah, we working. We sliding, trying to get it in. But yeah, I got some packages for this bike and some other ones. Not that one. We just got one package with some brand new rotors. I'm about to go pick up the other ones. People said it's a lot of them, so got me excited. Can't wait to see what came, man. Huh, Ace? Yeah. Well, we're about to go scope it out real quick, get these packages, then we're gonna be back in the shop, man. So stay tuned. We sliding. See you later. Package is coming. Got a whole set of wheels, front end, back, tire, and some extra stuff. So, so we made it to the shop. I had to grab all these packages out the truck, man. I'm so happy everything came because now I can get a lot of stuff on the road. Uh, we got some the internet fairing for this bike. I just mentioned that earlier. Now we got that in the mail. We got the whole complete rim set for this bike in the mail, and we got the 23 wraparound. See, I already done leaked it out. We're going 23, we're taking this 21 off, we're putting the Big Daddy on there. About to have that on there, but stay tuned. Like I said, we're gonna knock these little bikes out. Then we're about to go all in on this joint right here, transform this thing. But until then, we're collecting packages, so we're not waiting on nothing. That's what make the job easier. But I'm about to go finish knocking some stuff off, so we're gonna be back in the shop in a minute, man. Washing this joint down. Trying to clean this inside out. This thing is super dirty. Got this thing cleaned up. Good armor rod up. We just put up in the shop. Me and my dog. About to get this work in. Stay tuned for the day, man. The have and cop y'all sliding beanie. Please be sure to copy one, man. Things are going fast. Got a couple left, so try to get in while you can, man. We're about to knock this work out, though, so stay tuned for the movie. And also see my mountain of parts coming in and going out, so stay tuned. So basically, we're about to knock this bike out and finish it up today. I need this thing running and riding up out of here. Make sure today. If it ain't riding out, it's gonna be completely together. So, we're gonna get that exhaust bolted on here. And once we get that exhaust, we're about to wire them bars up and throw the handlebars on here. One of the connectors broke, but I got one from Harley. Gotta also take this uh, gas tank off, take the fuel pump out, change the peacock. So I gotta flood this gas out. Besides that, um, we gotta throw out a little small accessories on. We already got the wheels and tires on, as y'all can see. We gotta just throw on like the uh, blinkers, mirrors, all the little small stuff. With the exhaust, we got the shifter, floorboards, everything on, and I have to finish this bag right here. So I'm gonna finish this up. But I got some faith, y'all. We're about to get this thing on the road today, get this thing up out of here. Let's see what's going on. We got the wheels in that joint. Thing is finally back on the floor. About to be sliding. So stay tuned, y'all. Let's see what's going on. We're about to have this thing on the road.
we didn't complete it. The exhaust, we're about to finish off the um, handlebars so we can get that up on there, but we got both of the exhaust pipes on there. All we got like the blinkers, the bars with the gas tank console. Thought I had everything, but I just caught the dude. I didn't, I don't have everything. I need the fuel peacock for this. Thought I was gonna be having this thing starting, but that is a big part. So that's really about to hold me back. But in the meantime, I'm still about to throw the seat on, throw the bags and the bars on. And then like this last thing just be, but we making progress, we getting it on the road. We are gonna knock these little parts out. I had this thing complete. So stay tuned, man, let's see what's going on. So when I do my handlebars, I usually do them all at my house, but the newer bikes, the connectors are so small, I can make my magic work inside the shop. So I just wired up these right here using some damn fuel hole, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Now we got these bars wired, about to install these on the bike, put the mirrors and the grips with the brake line. So stay tuned, it's coming together more and more. Got the handlebars fully complete, got the new grips and the hand controls in there. So it's time to install them on this joint. Put the bars on here, they're gonna wire up these uh, brake and clutch lines. So let's get it. Move some things around and clean up. Got the road light pulled out the back and those all the way back there in the dark. Finally got it to the front. This thing is looking a lot much better. So basically the only things that we need and uh, I'm gonna have the owner get today or tomorrow. It's just really, this is the wrong light bar, but I do need this one for that blue one. The one I ordered for that one was the wrong one. So I really need to swap both of them. I'm gonna give the go from the owner and from then, we gotta just get two more uh, bolts for the exhaust, two more of those, the hand levers, and also, oh, I gotta get this piece of uh, sandblasted. They powder coat it over where the brake goes so I can't slide it on, but no biggie. We gonna have that thing up and going for sure by tomorrow. We got close to our goal though. And if I would have did the fuel pump, we really would have been running, but we don't have it on hand. And y'all know today is Monday, all Harleys are closed, except one that's super far out from LA. But this thing is on the road, man. He will be sliding this week, guaranteed for sure, dude. So stay tuned.